What is going on guys? I'm out here with Nicole, That Acura Girl. We are doing episode 12 and what's going on Nicole? Hi guys, I'm here with Javi. I guess we're gonna talk a little bit about my car, uh, Acura A-Spec with the nice blue in and the red interior. Woohoo! So let's get into it. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm out here with Nicole. So, Nicole, talk to me about your car. I'm just kind of going to let you just run through it. We're what year? It. And All tell right, me what so is it? I purchased a car about a year and a half ago. I do work in Miami Acura. I got it. It's the nice blue with the red interior. It's the steel night blue. So, I want to go ahead and go through it with you guys. What year is it? It's a 2018. Okay, and, it, and it's an A-Spec. It's an A-Spec. It was one of the first ones to come out. Um, it was the first one in my dealer that was red with, with the red interior with the blue outside. And I had to get it. No, you were like one of the it. first ones to get it? Yes. Because I'm always going on two years. So I'm in a year and a half in. Oh, okay. So, okay. yes, my lease is almost done too. Ooh, type S. Okay. <laughs> Yo, that's what's coming up now. Yes. All right, so run me through it a little bit. What you got? Okay, so I had to start with suspension for sure first. I went with the airlift suspension with the 3P management. Um, I wanted to go as low as possible. Obviously, here I'm not as low as I can. I will show you guys later. I did decide to go with the Rotoforms 20 by 9, 20 by 10 and a half in the rear with the copper finish. It did take me a good three months to get, but I got what I wanted. This is by 10 in the back? By 10 and a half in the back. 10 and a half. Also, oh, it's pretty wide. Yes. Okay. I went as wide as I can to go as low flame frame. And I'm sure, I mean, it's pretty low here. We could see that, but I'm sure. No, it's, it's very high right here. It's actually high there? Very, very high. Okay, so it, okay, so <laughs> I'll have to show you guys. <laughs> all right, we'll definitely leave that for the B rolls, and okay. we'll show it on the videos. But, but that looks to me, I mean, that looks to me, to me, very low actually. Even now, well, you're telling me it goes even lower. Yes, actually, I can go lay frame on this car. Really, like yes. just sit it on the floor. It will sit on the frame, and nice. you guys will. Uh, I will show you how. Awesome. So I want to ask you a question. So, you know, we've been doing this Acura series. Um, that we've been doing with Acura Honda Classic and myself, mm -hmm. which is obviously sponsored by Acura Pembroke Pines. There's not a lot of girls who build cars. I think in this mm -hmm. in this show that we've been um, putting out, I haven't seen a single girl with, with a car out here other than you. So what what gets you into cars? You know, usually girls are into well, other stuff. Well, actually, I've been into cars for almost 20. Years. And I don't want to stereotype her. Older than you guys would think I am. I do have two kids. Um, I've been into and actually Acura for a very long time. I own three Integras, and I started one of the first K-Swaps back in 2007. You had so a K-Swap? I had a K-Swap Integra. Did you finish it? I did. Nice. And I had AC and power steering. Nice. If you guys check me out on That Acura Girl, you can see a little bit on there as well. So you were so you were the original girl doing the K-Swap, other than, uh, what's her name, PR Beauty out in Orlando. She has a K-Swap SI or something like that. I don't know if you've seen her. Um, She's like one of the YouTubers, right hand drive, Kev. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, she has a K-Swap uh, EM1, but you know, you did it what? What year was that you did it? I did it back in 2007. Oh, Jesus. That was way long yes. before. I had her for about six years and then I got pregnant. And, and I that's it. And I to upgrade a little bit for more space. And now but that you got two kids, you now got a four door. I got two kids. I had to go with four door. I did have a TSX six speed though for a long time. I love that car. And so I started with Miami Acura about five years ago and then I traded in for the first 2015 Acura TLX, which is the ninth brown copper with espresso interior. And then this baby came out. Nice. So, <clears throat> we talked about the suspension. We talked about the Roddy form. What What do you got for? I see you got kind of like a, a lip. S Factor fabrication lip kit that goes all the way around. We call it a splitter kit. This is a splitter kit. It yes. goes around the whole it car. It goes around the whole car. I actually had to trace the car with cardboard to send it to the fabricator so he can get to pinpoint it exactly where I wanted it. Can What's the name of the company? Sorry to interrupt. S-Factor Fabrication. S -fact oh, we could actually see it here on the... Okay, okay, perfect. It goes all around the car. Um, if I drop the car, the front end pokes up a little bit. So the fabricator had it where it goes completely flush where I wanted it. Perfect. He got it exactly how I like it. Perfect, perfect. I want to move it into the interior, but do you have any engine mods? Have you done anything to the engine? Um, I only have an intake and... Power Rev Racing 
is a new sponsor of mine. He sent me a throttle body spacer that they're doing for this engine. I can feel a little bit of performance. Um, he's gonna send me some radiator hoses and some new intake stuff that we're gonna test out as well. It's gonna be for performance and of course to make the engine dress up a lot nicer. So this car has a sponsor now? I have quite a few. Oh, you have a quite a few, okay. I have Driveway Kingdom, which is my number one sponsor. He did my, the, I'll show you in the trunk in a little bit, the airlift suspension with the 3P management. He helped me out with the wheels and he's like my number one sponsor. He helps me a lot, especially with the car shows that we go to. Okay. So I, perfect, I like to perfect. bring him out a lot because he's, he's really into the game, he's into the scene, but he's into European. So I'm bringing him out into the JDM world. Okay, okay. So it's a little, it's a little bit of difference for him. You, you will be here on the 16th for the meet, right? I will be, and I'll be in the VIP section if you guys want to check out the car, have any questions. Awesome, awesome. So let's move on to. I actually want to see the trunk now that you mentioned the airlift system, and we'll move to there. All right, guys. So. You guys saw on the b-roll she is running nitrous it's not connected yet but it will be and it's it's pretty much set up you already ran the lines and everything's yes, good to go everything's run we're just waiting for the intake manifold to come in from the powder coat place and we'll have everything done hopefully in the next month or so it's just ready to go so actually so tell me a little bit about the back i mean we can see we can show people here that you have two nitrous bottle uh, well and you have I, the airlift. I started with the airlift very back back because i have two kids and i do go out a lot so i wanted more trunk space but i wanted to bring the nitrous into the car because a lot of people are going vip i i wanted to try to step away from the vip scene because that's a lot in the car show that i go to um it might be just a small shot, but it's going to be enough to show you guys on a dyno. You don't want to say how much? No, I'm not going to say how Okay, much. okay. <laughs> we'll keep it a secret. <laughs> so, two big bottles here. Everything's kind of just ready to go. Um, let's go into the interior. I want to check out the interior of this car. All right. All right, guys. So, I'm in the interior of the car and Nicole run me a little bit through the interior red interior okay here. so this is actually the first year Acura decided to do red and not accept the NSX so they brought it out to the TLX they wanted to bring more of the sport into our TLXs because 2015 to 17 it was just very sedanish so they wanted to do an A-spec edition which they brought the nice red interior I had to jump on it Okay, so and it's, it's leather, right? Yes, of course. Okay. It's all leather. They do have the touch buttons for the transmission. They have the dual display with the navigation. This car has like all the gadgets. It almost drives itself. Almost pretty much, huh? Yes. And then it did, also has the leather in the back, obviously. It has right? the leather in the back. I did buy the matching car seats. The kids have to ride in style as well. It is so crazy to see two car seats and then nitrous bottles in the back. That's <laughs> insane. But uh, and then you know you got the black headliner, yeah, sunroof. Yeah, with all the black accents. I th I think the black with red kind of gives it a nice contrast in the yeah. interior. And then if you have blue on the outside, it's it's a very nice touch and a very nice like it's. Because it, it is gives a, a nice... lot of colors coming together. So right, but I think but I think they complement each other. Brings it down a little. You know, I think they complement each other, and I think it goes well with it. Um, but yeah, I kind of want to move into the engine, and and then we'll just go into B-rolls because I'm sure everybody wants to see all that. So run me by the engine it looks pretty much stock other it's, than obviously probably the nitrous that's getting hooked up it is pretty stock i just went with a simple intake which you can hear hear really loud once the car is undone here you pop that up okay so you got the you spacer the, there okay and the throttle body spacer and then i did see on your instagram that you posted a pic of the getting the stuff put on i'm not gonna say what it was it's but, be, um, but it's almost done almost it's okay. gonna be out there so I want it to be a surprise, but not a surprise. I will be showing it off, of course, but I'm, we're still playing with it a little bit because it doesn't want to sit correctly, and then I want to do some custom stuff to another intake manifold. I will be using this one. Okay, okay. And then I can see here the... There's Driveway Kingdom. There it is. I have to represent them. And the lip, exactly how I wanted it. 
Exactly. So everything just kind of matches very nice. I want to see it uh, when you actually lay it down yeah. on the floor. I want to see how low it is. I, I've seen it on the meets. But, you know, there's just so many cars that I don't really pay no, attention too sure. much to it. And But I want to see it. I want to see it on the floor. So, let's yeah, let's... Yeah, let's get into some b -rolls. Let's do it. <laughs>